Welcome to Get Fit in a Few. I'm Logan, the instructor. And I'm Nami, the entertainment. Today we're going to show you a couple of things that you can do throughout the week. We're first going to start with a warm up. Then we're going to do the wow, which is the workout of the week. And then a cool down, just 10 minutes. 10 minutes to love your body. Let's go! So we're first going to start with the warm up. We're going to do three exercises. It's going to be inchworm, and then we're going to do air squats, and then we're going to do high knees. So first we're going to start with inchworm. You're going to stay on the back of your mat. And then you're going to squat, put your hands down, and walk yourself out, and then walk yourself back in. So what is this up. workout? This is just warming up your shoulders, it's warming up your legs. Um, yeah, it's just getting your heart rate up and getting it flowing. So we're going to do five more. Four. Oh, this is great. <laughs> Three. And one. Okay, next we're gonna do air squats. So you're gonna start with your feet shoulder width apart and then you're just gonna squat down. But make sure your knees don't go over your toes. So I stick my booty out. <laughs> yeah, you stick your booty out and your chest up. <laughs> <laughs> How many of these will we do? We're gonna do 10, so we have six more. Okay. Five, four, three, two, and one. All right, next we're gonna do high knees. Oh. This is to get your heart rate up. As you can see, mine's already up. <laughs> and we're gonna do 20, so we're gonna do like alternating one, two, three, four. Ready? One, two, three, four, five, six. How high do I have to go? 10. Just as high as you feel comfortable. <laughs> All right, and then three, two, one. Okay, that's it for the warm up. Now we're gonna get into the wow, the workout of the week. All right, now we're gonna do the wow. Take it away, Logan. Okay, so this one is gonna be three circuits. First one's gonna be an arm circuit, a leg circuit, and then an ab circuit. So we're first gonna start with the arm circuit. The arm circuit is gonna consist of push-ups, a plank, and tricep dips. Oh, man. So I'm gonna give you a quick example, and then we're gonna do that for 10, 10, and then 30 seconds. All right, okay? So the first one we're gonna do is a push-up. So get down, push-up position. Your feet are, your toes are kind of, I don't know if you can see my toes, they're kind of against the ground. If this is too hard for you, I'll um, modify. Yeah, show me the modification. <laughs> um, but you're gonna go down, you can do elbows out, or you can do elbows all the way tucked in. And we're gonna do 10, okay? Yeah. Ready? <laughs> one. <laughs> Two. We're not gonna make it. Three. <laughs> Four. You can do it. Fire up. Six. Six seven, seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. ten. Woo. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Next is gonna be the tricep dips. So you're gonna lay sit on your mat. I'll turn sideways for you. Your hands are gonna be facing forward. Your feet comfortably underneath you. Yep. And then you're gonna lift up your bum, and then you're just gonna go dip down. How many? We're gonna do 10. Two. Three. Three. Let me use it behind. Four. Five. Six. Six. You should feel it burning in the back of your arms. Oh yeah, I feel it burning. <laughs> Nine. 10. Woo. Okay. Next we're gonna do a plank. This is gonna be on your mat. This whole thing will be on your mat, laying down. You're gonna put your arms shoulder width apart. High plank. Yes, high plank. This is a high plank. If this is too hard for you, then you can go lower or you can even put your knees down. We're gonna hold this for 30 seconds. One, two, <laughs> three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, Man, 11, it's not getting a little bit rocky. 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, Woo! 20. Keep it up. <laughs> you can do it. <laughs> Eight, 29, 30. Okay, so that is the arm circuit. Um, you can just do one set like we just did, or you can do three sets. Okay. 
Now we're going to do a leg circuit. We're going to do the same kind of setup. It's going to be three exercises. 10 reps, 10 reps, and then 30 seconds. So the first one what we're going to do is lunges. You're going to stand on your mat and you're going to take one foot forward and lunge down. Then you're going to take your left foot forward and lunge down. That's one. Alright, that's one. Two. Dang! You have to do each leg what 10 times. What do I do with my hands? Can Three. I put my hands on my hips? You can put your hands on your hips. Try to keep your um, torso straight up. Don't lean over like this. Okay. You should feel this in your quad, in your glutes, which is your bum. No, I've always heard that word. I have no idea what it means. <laughs> Do you know what number we're on? I don't know. I think number seven. All right, we'll go with that. Eight. Eight. <laughs> Nine. One more. And ten. Okay, the next set is uh, we're going to do side lunge lunges. So you're going to take your left foot out to the side, and you're going to lunge down. You're going to bring your feet back to the middle. Take your right foot, lunge down. That's one. Is that one? Yep. It's two. two. All right. I got it. Three. What does this work? This works the same muscles, but it's more of your left side and right side of your glutes. Huh. So it's just a little bit different. You should feel your thighs burning. This is number six, by the way. I'm glad you're counting, because I'm not. <laughs> oh, man. You really get it in your heart. Great. Yep, your heart rate's raising. It's going up. What is that? Last one? This is no nine. This is nine, people. We can do it. One, one more. more. Come on. Okay. Woo All right. The third. Workout that we're gonna do in the leg circuit is called skaters. We're gonna do this for 30 seconds like we did the plank. And how it's gonna go, you're gonna start on the left side of your mat and you're gonna jump this time to the right side of your mat. You can put your foot down if you need to. We're also gonna touch. So it's gonna look like this. Okay? All right. And we're gonna start and do that for 30 seconds. Watch Nami if you need modification. Ready, go. You can do this quicker to make it harder, or you can do it slow and controlled. Whatever you feel comfortable doing. Man, nobody ever thinks 30 seconds is long <laughs> until you're doing this. <laughs> but really, like, you got it. I got I mean, five more seconds. I brush my hair, braid my hair for longer than 30 seconds. I can do this. And stop. Well done. Okay, like I said in the arm circuit, that's just one set. You can do three sets of those, or you can keep it one, whatever fits you. All right guys, we've got one more circuit left, just the abs, and then after that it's the cool down. Make sure you have a sip of water, don't down it, and then we'll do the cool down after this. Take it away Logan. Okay, so we're gonna do the same kind of thing. We're gonna do three exercises with our abs. Um, instead of doing 10, 10, 30, we're gonna do 10, 30, 30. So the first exercise is gonna be similar to a plank and then we're gonna be on the ground for the rest of the time. So we'll start off with the first exercise. Get on your mat. And we're gonna, these are called um, plank taps. So we're here and then we're just tapping our shoulders. That's one, two, two. two. three, four, Five, six, seven, get it heavy. Eight, <laughs> do this. Nine, ten. Okay, then on your knees, we're gonna sit on our mat. Um, we'll turn sideways just for demonstration. All right. All right, so the first one, or the second one we're gonna do, you're gonna pretend that you're pulling a rope. So you're gonna put your feet up and you're gonna cross them. All right. You're gonna put your hands in front of you and then you're gonna act like you're pulling yourself up a rope. What is this working? This is working your abs. <laughs> it's working. Um, as you're going up and down, it's hitting all sides from the lower abs to the upper abs. 13, that's where we're at. Yep. Remember we said 30 of them. You're kind of pulsating 20. up and down. Yo, my abs are burning. 4, 25, 6, 27, 28, 29, 30. All right. Take a quick break if you need it, get some water. Um, but the third exercise that we're gonna do, it's called a Russian twist. 
This time your feet are gonna be on the ground. Thank goodness. And then you're gonna lean back, just kinda like you did like a 45 degree angle. You can put something in your hands if you wanna make it harder, put a weight in your hands. If not, just kinda make your fists together. And you're gonna go side to side. Which side of my abs is it just like the? Yeah, this is working your obliques all on the side. This is five. You can tap it however far you can go over. We're gonna do 30 of them. This is 10. Take a break if you need it, get water. If not, not push through. through. Guys. <laughs> hey, you never know what people need, man. Alright. <laughs> 20! 10 more, you can do it. I know it's burning, mine's burning. It's okay if you feel it some in your back too. Okay, good, because I was feeling that. This is 8, 29, 30! Well done, well done. We're gonna go straight into our cool off. This is where you can get water at any time you want. <laughs> but since we just worked our abs, we're actually gonna stretch that first. So get kind of like you're going into a plank or a push up. And just kind of relax and then you're gonna push yourself up. Keep your pelvis and your hips on the ground. You should feel that pull in your abs. If that's too hard to do, can I do this? Yes. Definitely can. They call this the cobra. <laughs> what is this? <laughs> I don't know. A dog. <laughs> uh, Keith, don't forget to breathe while you're doing this. How do I breathe? Do I breathe through my nose or my mouth? Through your nose and out your mouth. Okay, get up on all fours. You can even lean back if you want to. It's oh, called child's pose. This is nice. Woo. Hold that for 30-ish seconds. This is just stretching out our shoulders some and our back. Honestly, just bringing our heart rate down. Okay. Next, we're gonna stand up. We're gonna stretch some of our arms since we just worked that. Take your right arm, pull it across your chest. Pull with your left arm. So each one of these circuits to be the most effective, I need to do it how many times? We just did it one here on the show, but you can do it three depending on your time, um, and just your ability, or yeah, you can just even do it one, it'll be effective as well. Yeah, because I feel, I feel pretty good. <laughs> You're sweating and going down once. <laughs> Alright, shake that out. Do the other arm. <laughs> Alright, shake that out. Now you're going to take your right arm and you're going to put it and touch as far back as you can on your back. Then take your left arm and you're going to pull it just a little bit, not much. Does that help my back? Because I always have tension in my shoulder plates. Yeah, it's actually going to help some of your triceps in this area right here. Cool. That we worked in the push-ups. All right, go ahead and switch. Whew. Okay. All right, in the last exercise, we're going to go back on the mat. Exercise and pull down. <sighs> cool down. <laughs> I'm just making sure we're not doing any more. <laughs> you're going to lay on your back. You're going to pull your right knee towards you and over. You can use your left hand to assist. You can put your right hand out for balance. Look that sun. This uh, is stretching the glutes. Yep. That we worked out. I feel that. Alright. Alright, then we can switch. There's no sign here, so this is great. Oh, that's <laughs> <Sorry>. <laughs> uh, okay, and sit up slowly. And that's our workout for the day. Woohoo! And the week. Feel free to do this once a day for the next week. That's right. And uh, yeah, we'll be back next week.